Hey Credit Warriors, Credit Shifu here and today we are checking out the Plaza Premium Lounge at London Heathrow Airport's Terminal 5. I have visited the Plaza Premium Lounge in Hong Kong, which is part of Priority Pass. The one at London Heathrow isn't, but you can get in for free by showing your Amex Platinum. However, that isn't the method I used this time. Let me explain. So we are in the Plaza Premium Lounge at Heathrow Terminal 5. Amex Platinum members get access to this uh, free of charge, complimentary, but we did a very stupid thing and forgot our Amex Platinum in our check-in luggage. Uh, so we actually... I I, good, good, you did it. Um, she did it, she ate, she ate a little bit of bread. But anyway, back to what we're talking about. Um, we left our Amex Platinum in our check-in luggage, uh, so we actually ended up having to pay. Uh, you, have to, you have to actually present the physical card to get in for free. Um, but since, you know, it's not that long until our flight, because we faffed around, like, calling Amex to see, uh, and they couldn't do anything about it, unfortunately. They did try, um, but they, in the end, said you have to have the physical card. Um, so they reduced the price for us. They, uh, they let us in for £30 per person and the kids for free instead of £40, because uh, we kind of wasted so much time messing around. So, good job, Plaza Premio, for doing that. Thanks very much. Much appreciated. And um, it's quite a nice lounge. So, uh, well, let's check it out. I paid with the Sapphire Reserve, hoping that it will count towards a $300 travel credit. But after checking in some online forums, it seems it probably won't. It depends how it codes on your statement. Oh well. The food in this lounge is pretty good, with many hot and cold options on offer. Mrs. Credit Shifu had an Indian curry and some parsnips. I had this plate of cold stuff, couscous, a salad and some mortadella. One of the highlights was this lemon mousse, which was awesome. As for the drinks, they had these flavoured waters, which I really like. My favourite one was the lemon and mint. The apple juice was also really good, apparently. Is it good? They also had one of my favourite coffee machines, the Swiss-made Thermoplan. So I grabbed myself a cappuccino. The lounge is built in an exposed area of the airport and has windows so you can plane watch. Basically the same deal as the Aspire Lounge, which is part of Priority Pass. But the difference is that the Plaza Premium Lounge is quieter probably because it isn't in Priority Pass. The Plaza Premium Lounge has a shower, but I didn't use it. Washroom was nice though. They also made the effort to put up a Christmas tree. I don't think you're allowed to take the presents home though. So I am testing out this pretty cool little seat, you can see. It's like your own enclosed little space. And uh, obviously they've got like uh, quite good power outlets on the wall. You've got a couple of USBs here. You've got a, uh, you know, British style power outlet. And then you've got this light which, uh, oh my God, that's bright. <laughs> Sorry about that. But, oh, that looks cool actually, isn't that cool? Um, and you can just sort of twist it a little bit. I don't really know, probably a reading light or something. Anyway, pretty cool. Just be aware that they don't announce flights here, so pay attention to the departure screen. If you're leaving from the B or C gates, leave about 15 minutes before boarding, since you'll have to take a train. For the A gates, probably five to seven minutes should suffice. Then you can get on your 787 Dreamliner and be whisked off home. Guys, what do you think of this lounge? I rate it a little bit better than the Aspire Lounge, also in Terminal 5, but both are reasonably good. We are back in the good old USA now, and we will be going back to the usual content this week. If you like travel and going to airport lounges, why not check out our collection of travel credit card deals from our partners? These are affiliate links, so we thank you very much if you do use them, and if you want to see our advertiser disclosure, it's in the bottom of the description section of this video. Please subscribe if you're new, give this video a like, and we'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye. Because there are so many things that I left. I